Cobra 3 E-mini NASDAQ continues to be my favorite strategy in this market. You see last week's trades. Monday was a short into the close. Friday was a short into the close. I think these were the the uh, the real trend of the week was Monday and Friday, and that Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday were uh, you know propping uh, this week two losers in a row. So it's a good time to get in. Let's take a look at the consecutive winners and losers on this. This is going back to 12-1-2017. Nice results. You have a maximum of losing of maximum consecutive losing trades is four. During this time frame, historically, it can be larger than that, but this strategy is in the zone. Let's take a look on the trade analysis tab, the losing series one. That's happened 19 times. Uh, two losing trades in a row, 19 times as well. Three losing trades happen, has happened five times, and four losing trades has happened four times in this time period. And so this is the strategy that I like the most going into today after it's had two losers these losses were in exited at the end of the day so they didn't hit their stop loss let's take a look at the periodical returns minus 105 minus 305 here is the equity curve and so this strategy is in the zone this is the one that I recommend the most right now as markets continue to go through periods of consolidation and chop followed by periods of trend and so Cobra 3 has a tendency to capture the trend and this is the strategy that I want to be on would want to be on the next time that there is another trend like this or like this even like this last Tuesday it gave back some gains but some nice results and so two losers in a row Cobra 3 E-mini NASDAQ and looking at the next opportunity for this